let us see one beautiful question in uh, three phase transformer harmonics okay actually till now i have never seen in any exam problem coming out of like you know harmonics this is a really beautiful question and uh, jagdish challa and jyotish actually because of these two guys only i came to know about this question thank you dear next thing is like you know whoever attended my transformers classroom classes till now they'll be easily able to understand and whoever joined a bit better coaching and better faculties uh, they will like you know without much friction they will understand and whoever are like you know very fresh and all they may take some time basically i did not discuss harmonics in three phase transformer i'm not going to also because like you know it's completely theoretical analysis 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 will be there and like you know at the end some conclusions we will get just to get like you know few conclusions we have to discuss a lot at this point of time like you know just before get exam i don't think it's uh, right to discuss that's why i avoided that and anyway in detailed course about that in detail harmonics will come okay now let us see this question Three identical single phase transformers have their rated voltages of 200 volts, 150 volts, 100 volts, respectively, for primary, secondary, and tertiary. Windings. The primary is connected in star to three phase sinusoidal supply of 433 volts. The secondary also connected in star. The voltmeter, when connected across the open circuit at delta of the tertiary winding, gave reading of 120 volts. What is the phase voltage on the secondary if tertiary delta is open circuited? Okay, so basically, if you don't have any harmonic component, okay, means in delta, even if it is open delta or closed delta, net voltage will be zero. For example, if it is like this, okay, if I have, if I don't have any harmonic component, VA plus VB plus VC or VAB plus VBC plus VCA, because that is the main advantage of three phase okay compared to two phase so for example if i draw this if i draw this if i draw this okay such that this plus this plus this is going to be zero okay so though in the question they did not say anything about the harmonic components okay because nowhere they mentioned harmonic they said that sinusoidal supply only is being provided for the primary side but still they said like you know only small information the voltmeter when connected across open circuit at delta of the tertiary winding gave 120 volts okay because if it is open circuited open circuited delta open circuited delta if it is like you know three phase sinusoidal net voltage should be zero so net voltage is not zero means that it's a harmonic component okay means i will try to connect these two power systems zero sequence currents such that like you know you'll be able to understand a bit better okay even though you don't under you do if you don't understand much like you know don't bother much in detail course everything will be launched and for time being gate 2020 try to remember as it is like you know this is the way this is the way this is the way like that okay so input is star star delta so this is primary star and secondary is star and tertiary is delta open circuited delta open circuited delta okay so in primary for example this is connected with source okay so whatever i'm saying try to remember okay that doesn't mean that i don't know analysis okay i know analysis i will prove all these statements in my detailed session and if time permits like you know because power system is also pending much work is pending and i'm trying my level best to do my work okay but still like you know try to remember as it is okay for example in power system analysis is it possible to have zero sequence currents here no why because in zero sequence currents i'm not saying zero sequence and triplet harmonic is same but they behave same in the analysis point of view leave it for example if it is phase a current the same should be phase b current the same should be phase c current such that ia plus ib plus ic equal to three times ia three times ia either in zero sequence currents of power systems or unbalanced uh, system are kind of triplet harmonic also for example if it is fundamental if it is fundamental 
okay such that at any instant at any instant ia plus ib plus ic equal to zero or va plus vb plus vc equal to zero or vab plus vbc plus vca whatever it may be it's going to be zero okay so is it possible to have zero sequence currents no because at one instant if it is two amperes at the same instant it will be in the same direction two amperes in the same direction it will be two amperes so there is no return path okay similarly the triple n hormone currents also cannot flow okay because they behave the same so here triple n harmonic currents cannot go in the what they say no load current okay so because of lack of let me write it again this is going to be i zero triple n harmonic current cannot go because of lack if you don't have current triple n harmonic flux will come try to remember that way okay so because of lack of triple n harmonic current triple n harmonic flux come okay so because of this triple n harmonic flux triple n harmonic voltages will be induced in each phases okay so triple n harmonic voltages triple n harmonic voltages will be induced here also because triple n harmonic frequency sorry triple n harmonic frequency or triple n harmonic flux is there so voltage will be there now if you observe if you observe for example across this how much will be the triple n harmonic voltage okay so at one instant for example if it is 10 volt 10 volt at the same instant it will be 10 volt at the same instant it will be because all these waveforms are same is going to be 10 volt so plus 10 minus 10 is going to be zero triple n harmonic is going to be zero okay so triple n harmonic voltage triple n harmonic voltage cannot exist in line but can exist only in phases okay now let us extend this discussion now triple n harmonic voltage for example how much will be the triple n harmonic voltage across this triple n harmonic voltage in the line will be zero but triple n harmonic voltage will be there across phases triple n harmonic voltage will be there in phases but triple n harmonic component will not be there across line now because of this triple n harmonic flux if voltages are induced here if voltages are induced here only triple n harmonic i'm discussing because about fundamental you know i know everyone know okay so for example if it is triple n harmonic if it is triple n harmonic at one instant it is having like you know 10 volts at the same instant if it is having 10 volts at the same instant if it is having 10 volts so net is going to be net is going to be three times or not yes okay so net is going to be three times so three times voltage is going to be how much they have given 120 volts there lies the logic okay so triple n harmonic voltage across open circuited delta is going to be 120 volts okay so how much will be per phase voltage triple n harmonic is going to be 120 by 3 is going to be 40 volts okay now basically in the question a small correction need to be done they have given 200 volts 150 volts 100 volts as the rated voltages rather than that they should have given 200 is to 150 is to 100 like you know they have given kind of turns ratio okay so if you supply 200 volts to the primary here means you are going to get 150 volts here and you are going to get 100 volts here okay now for example let us split this let us split this for example this is primary and this is secondary okay so let us think of fundamental fundamental now fundamental how much he applied 433 volts 433 volts if you apply fundamental 433 fundamental 433 by root 3 how much will be from here to here that voltage will be 200 is to 150 it will be reduced again this particular voltage into root 3 is going to be line voltage so fundamental line voltage here fundamental line voltage here directly is going to be 433 into 150 by 200 getting my point right so this is going to be only fundamental i'm not bothered about triple n harmonic as of now okay so 433, uh, 433 into 3 by 4 is going to be 324.75 volts this is what fundamental okay so fundamental voltage across line we got this okay so means let us think of how much will be the phase voltage fundamental phase voltage fundamental phase voltage fundamental fundamental is going to be 
324.75 by root 3. This is fundamental. Now, here in this case, triple end harmonic voltage is there in phase or not. A cross line triple end harmonic will not be there, but in phase triple end harmonic voltage will be there. So, triple end harmonic voltage will be with the frequency of 150H. Fundamentally is with the frequency of 50H. So, if I want to combinedly, like you know, calculate uh, what do you say, net induced voltage per phase, okay, I have to consider RMS, okay. So, fundamentally is calculated. Now, from here to here, here to here, if I have phase voltage of 150 volts in the secondary, I am going to have phase voltage of 100 volts in tertiary. So, if I have 40 volts here, if I have 40 volts here, how much will be this voltage? Triple and harmonic, triple and harmonic, okay. So, for example, this side, I am going to have 40 volts here per phase, okay. So, per phase, how much this will be? So, that is going to be 40 into 150 by 10, 100, okay. So, you are going to get this voltage, okay. So, across this triple and harmonic, I got it. Across this fundamental, I got it. So, combinedly, this and this, try to calculate. So, what is net RMS value is going to be 40 into 150 by 100 square plus 324.75 by root 3 square under root is going to give you 196.86 volts. Okay. So, in the options given, in the options given 201, 324, 222, 275. Actually, near, near to this is 196. Actually, we got 196.86 or 197 volts. So, it is not 201.9. It is going to be 196 volts. Okay. If you don't understand, try to revise, revise, revise. Like, you know, rewatch it, rewatch it. Definitely, you have to understand this because if at all, if they want to give problem in harmony, this is going to be the best question.